So they're hating on my man Lil Dirk. They're throwing a lot of allegations on Dirk. People ain't minding their business. Y'all know about his baby mama. Alleged, alleged. Let's get that out the way. Even if the baby looks like him or not, alleged. Until Dirk himself speaks on it and confirm it. I can't go off like that. Now go watch my channel and go watch the video I dropped earlier. I don't know which one I'm dropping first, but I covered that situation and broke it down with the receipts. Now it's up to y'all to decide which y'all want to believe. Now this right here is the Carmelo's former wife, Lala Anthony situation. Now they're saying Lala, you know, was in some grips of things, meaning that allegedly she was in a situation with little dirk that caused india to put out that now she's a free agent now as far as her being a free agent that's normal in my mind a lot of people go back and forth a lot of and then people seen and show that they unfollowed each other and i mean my wife is slick when i argue with my wife and she puts things on her phone like she'll change my name from hubby or husband and put it my child's father like like she'll be slick or me if she's texting me too much while i'm driving and i don't want to crash or get in some type of weird situation while i'm driving because you know we got anger for real i'll block her for like probably <laughs> probably 20 minutes just to you know so she could chill and then i unblock it because you don't want an emergency something to happen so i'm looking at it as a situation like that break up to make up to break up to make up this is the reality of things but you know um this lady put it up there this was the fake account they tried to make it look like it was india who responded to this message here but the message came from the alleged baby mama's fake account which is not for her and she also said india and little dirk allegedly broke up over a month ago don't blame her for it you know what i mean she had nothing to do with it which if that's the case would i find that hard to believe but also at the same time i would have to roll with it because i don't know what's the possibility or the burden of truth now let's keep going more this beautiful baby they tried to say is dirk's baby i'm not gonna lie it looks like dirk baby but i also have cousins this baby looked like it's a beautiful baby the cousins of mine look just like this baby too meaning that dirkio got strong genes also he has a facial feature that you pretty much ask somebody around you you can see a baby around you and people will ask ain't that your baby because the mind can do things man you you won't believe then the baby mama said that news came out all the way back in uh january that news came out about the baby and the situation with that now with lala anthony you got to remember lala has been through a lot of situations you know like as far as when she fell down from her mtv time hosting it during the early 2000s to meeting a young 19 year old carmelo and marrying him and, and them being together well i don't know if she married him at 19 but i know they were together when he was 19 and, and, and we thought it was a cool thing because i've been with older women before i had no negativity as far as seeing what she could possibly bring to to a dirk life but by saying that and getting into that you would be equating yourself to saying that you know what i'm saying there was trouble there was a situation of a marital affair and because i don't know that i can't just go and with my withdrawals and just be like hey y'all he was with lala anthony now people will give credence to everything sometimes it's like where there's smoke there's fire so i feel like maybe there is some smoke there i don't know but when people going deeply with it and even publications you know you gotta at least be a journalist and do your part to present the news in the right way that's what i'm trying to do i'm being very fair and balanced but it's one of them things it's, it's a juicy news for for people out here it's a very controversial topic that brings views money and it goes viral and people can create their own narratives with it because it's so open a lot of them feel like they really can't get sued so they go deeper with it and, and, and man they throw everything together in one to the point it looks believable it looks like it's reality and in a sense it might just be nothing and even if it was something it's just the patterns aren't matching up that's what i wanted to say about that now dirk hasn't made any responses to any of these allegations or things nor should he if he don't feel like it he doesn't owe it to anybody to speak about who he's with or not with or his if his relationship is 
done or not I, I don't understand why people feel that folks have to give you some type of explanation for what happened in their life if you ain't doing some educational purpose geppetto activities out here or some strange dealings you don't have to explain yourself to nobody because these things are typical and normal i can attest to that because i've been in situations like that thus the reason for me having a hundred kids yes i i dibbled and dabbled in different baby mama situations and i can relate to it and if you can't relate to it i don't know how more to explain it than watching this video I, i'm doing right now at the very moment because i'm pretty sure i've touched on many key points if he was with lala anthony and it made him happy then i have no issues with that because if him and the woman that's called india or if, if they're really broken he would be at a right and to be honest with you even if he wasn't broken up with her that would be about their relationship what type of relationship they have together to judge that and here's the other part that's probably laughable what if and this is a big what if what if nothing even happened between him and lala anthony and it's just smokes and mirrors and now it's one of the biggest news because it didn't even hit the fan yet wait till at least a week if a week goes by and there's still some smoke and fire in this story it would be even everywhere and be more prominent the best thing for little dirk right now is not to even respond to that because if he truly is broken up with india right now he has a lot to worry about because i'm pretty sure he truly loves her he showed unconditional love to her when he does his speeches he does his videos with her he's everywhere with her he incorporated india into his everyday life even when he said i give my gun to Indy, like like you gotta respect that a man that truly honors his wife and or, or his woman is a truly respectable man so we all fall down you know donnie mcclurkin got a song says we fall down but we get up and and i and it's the get up part that gets me people don't want you to get up no more they want you to stay where the gravels lay and that's not the thing in this situation it's things that can be fixed and if this is true it's still a beautiful life that was brought to this world no matter what type of higher moral compass a lot of you guys are trying to look at the situation it's still a it's still something that dirk india and this alleged person if it's true they have to walk in their own shoes with it and get it fixed according to their standards or whatever they want to do but all we can do is report the news and give it to you in a fair and unbiased way i don't think you'll find any other content creators such myself who has no ulterior motives i don't have any reasons to do and say what we're pushing out there but lala is a grown woman little dirk is a grown man india is a grown woman and i'm pretty sure they will figure it out hopefully for the best interest of this alleged child if that's the case even if dirk is not the dad i hope even the alleged baby mother gets some reckoning as far as with her own spiritual essence you know what i mean and she is beautiful a lot of y'all were saying she's not beautiful and you guys were saying a lot of names i don't know if she's dirt baby mama or not i don't really honestly care but as far as people calling her ugly i'm here to tell this beautiful woman listen uh i think it's destiny you are a beautiful woman some things you shouldn't shouldn't have to worry about and some things you shouldn't have to chase just take a chill pill like a wise man once told me in middle school take a chill pill look y'all i'm dj bless one make sure you hit that like button and notification bell thank you for rocking with i smoke hip-hop live peace